All right, so time for the big announcement. I'm hanging up the old tool belt. April Fools! <laughs> for a new one, that's right. You thought I was quitting because I look old. But this tool belt has had better days. So I'm going to unload it. Tool belts are a unique things. Sometimes they hold sodas. More often, usually it's tools. But if you take a look at this tool belt, you can see it's pretty ragged looking. On the bottom, there are holes. It's worn through. So as I walk around the job site, I'm dropping nails and everything behind me. So, this, I was going, going to show you what I kind of basically wear or have for tools in the tool belt. So, let's go get the other one. Okay, I've gone for lighter weight. So, this one actually has a, a picture of a carpenter on there. So, it must be a real tool belt. I like this one because it has uh, a bag in the front. I'm going to start putting my tape measure in there. Um, let me just get this thing figured out. It uh, buckles. I'm, it's designed to be worn like this. Let me get this button buckled with the bags kind of back here so you can bend over easily and whatnot. However, I am not that dexterous. I need it on the front. So I'll just buckle it. Need a place to put my microphone. Hold on a minute. Let's just see if he'll stay there. Okay. So the first thing we need So, so, those are the tools. Here's a few tools of the trade. Just wanted to point out no tools were injured or put in harm's way during this video. So there you have it. That's it. Hope you enjoyed this short little video. Please subscribe if you're not a subscriber. We will actually have real videos of garage building mostly. But we're finishing up a project uh, for the next week or two. Then we'll be on to garages and other things. So thanks again for watching.